We will be using Google Calendar to check out resources now, instead of using an Excel spreadsheet. So if I want to check out a computer lab or an iPad cart, I log into my Google account and then select Calendar. Once I'm signed into Calendar, I need to make sure that I have access to the correct resource. So if I look under Other Calendars, I will see a list of things that have been shared with me. In this case, I want to check out the Middle School iPad Cart 1, and here it is, so I have access to it. Uh, it's currently turned on because the box next to it is purple. If I click on it, you can see that it's turned off, and that little box turns white. So I want to make sure that the box is colored whatever color your calendar happens to have it. So I want to actually go to the day where I'm going to check this cart out, which is going to be September 8th. So I'm going to need to navigate to that date. There are several ways I can do that. Uh, I'm going to click on the month view and then use my arrows to jump ahead a few months to September 8th. I actually want to see the day view, so I'm going to click on the number 8. And here I have Monday's schedule for the middle school calendar as well as my calendar. And there's nothing here. So that tells me that no one else has checked out that cart which is good. So to go ahead and add my reservation, I'm going to click Create. I'm going to title my reservation with my name so other people will know who has checked it out. So I have my date here. Uh, I want to change my time from 8 in the morning to 12.30. So I want to have it checked out until lunchtime. And you can always go in and add whatever class period times that you need. Uh, even if you click here and you don't see, you know, like 145 listed, you can actually um, type those specific times into these boxes. Okay, so I have my time. I need to actually tell my event what I want to check out. So it's very important. I need to go over to Add and click on Rooms. These are where our resources are going to be listed. So I see that I have the middle school iPad cart here, and I click Add. Unless I click Add, that event will not book that resource for me. Once I've clicked Add, you can see in the Where box, it has listed the middle school iPad cart 1. So at this point, if I want to just double check my schedule, I can click on uh, this Find a Time option here, and it will pull up my calendar next to the middle school iPad cart calendar. So I can ensure that I have checked out the right times. I did put in 12.30 noon and not 12.30 midnight. That happens sometimes. So everything looks good. Once I'm done, I can click Save. And you're going to notice that we see two different purple boxes. And the reason we're seeing this event twice is that it made a copy for my calendar. So I will know that I have a reservation at that time. And you'll also see another box. In this case, it's kind of stripey. This is the iPad cart calendar, and I can double check that by looking at this purple, and it matches the middle school iPad cart color, and this sort of blue purple matches my calendar. So my event has been added, and other people will know that I had that checked out on Monday, September 8th in the morning.